Elected leaders in Knoxville are about to decide whether to invest in a new kind of homeless shelter. Volunteer Ministry Center plans to renovate the old Salvation Army thrift store building. That nonprofit is looking for city tax dollars to help fund the project. Tennis reporter Sean Franklin explains those plans. The signage still says Salvation Army here at this building on Broadway, but the city is looking to help Volunteer Ministry Center change that by changing this into a low barrier shelter with 48 beds inside. The building on Broadway hasn't been the Salvation Army thrift store for quite a while. Now, something new is forming there that will help Knoxville's homeless community. Meet them where they're at. City Councilwoman Lauren Ryder says the proposed 48-bed shelter Volunteer Ministry Center is putting together will be the next piece in helping the homeless. The goal is to get them into some kind of long-term recovery. It will cost the city $245,000 in assistance. Ryder says since the city created a day space under the I-40 bridge over Broadway, Businesses in her district have seen more of the displaced homeless around town. They're camping on door stoops in parking lots. Some of them will get up and move before the business day starts. Some of them leave their bedding. VMC CEO Bruce Spangler wants to address that problem. He says what they call a low barrier shelter just means there won't be as many limitations on who can use it. So the shelter will allow people who maybe abuse alcohol or drugs under certain conditions. The shelter will only allow people referred by street outreach workers at places like Helen Ross McNabb and the Knoxville Knox County Community Action Committee. He says those in the shelter must be actively working to find a permanent home. Ryder says the shelter will start to address a larger problem, mental health treatment. Until we address as a community, as a culture, how we're going to expand mental health care for those who need it, we've seen a steady rise in those that... Uh, are lacking in access to those resources. Knoxville City Council will discuss more about the possibilities tonight at their meeting. Back to you. We'll keep an eye on that. Thank you, Sean. Councilwoman Ryder hopes that her colleagues will vote for that project tonight. Leaders at VMC says the new shelter would also complement the city's newly renovated day space for homeless under the bridge along Broadway.